What's up guys, Minibean75 here, and today I'm back with another build in Minecraft. This guy's, if you guys already don't know what this is by looking at it, this is the uh, Field of Dreams movie field and the MLB field. I basically just wanted to put all to, uh, both of them together with the Field of Dreams uh, game uh, happening today. Literally from when I'm recording this, it starts in like an hour. Um, and I wanted to get this done before game time, so I really decided to cut it close. But this is going to be it, guys. I think it looks awesome. If I kind of jump down here a little bit more, you'll be able to see more of the uh, the corn. And that is, to me, the part that absolutely just sets this thing apart. So let's first pop over here, and we'll just kind of fly around quick so we can take a look at the actual MLB field. As you can see there, we've got the scoreboard. And so far, it's the uh, it looks like bottom of the sixth, top of the seventh. And the Cubs are winning 3-1. to one. Um, who knows how the game's actually going to go, but I just, you know, I needed to put a little something in there. Um, if we pop over here, this is going to be the bullpen, um, for both teams. And then if we pop over here, this is going to be just a big screen. It's basically the big screen that's going to be showing, you know, who's coming up to bat or yada yada, whatever they have going on like they normally do in, um, MLB games. Here we've just got a shed. Uh, we've got the lights there, which I absolutely love how these lights turned out. Um, around the field. The field itself I'm really happy with too because I went through and I put in some different colors to try to make the different shades um, from like when they mow the grass and everything and I, I think it looks super super awesome. The ball diamond itself looks I think looks really really good. We've got the two different colors of uh, sand in there depending on which part of the actual field it is and then we've got the pitcher's mound here which I actually ended up using sandstone because it made it too high if I use sand. But I think it looks awesome. I feel like it's perfectly uh, perfectly placed and it's just up high enough where you can tell it's the mound. Uh, we've got both uh, dugouts there, just the seats and the press boxes there. Nothing too crazy on that side. Let's pop over here and we can kind of take a look a little bit of what's back here. There's not a ton. Um, normally, obviously today when the game's happening, there's going to be a ton of stuff back here. Um, but from pictures and everything I could find, it's kind of hard to tell exactly what's back here. Um, so I basically just kind of did my best. So like down here, we've got just a few porta potties. Uh, we've got just like a little shed here. We've got some tents there. Here we've got some uh, semi trailers, just a bunch of different colored ones. Another building there. Then on the back side, there are two big buildings on each side. I don't know if that's like what they use for the teams uh, as like locker rooms. I'm not sure. Then we've got a couple little tents down there. Another uh, uh, semi trailer there. And then kind of the same thing over here. We've got three more semi-trailers, couple a uh, couple more buildings. And then we've got like the stairs that will bring you up into the stands. There we've got a camera spot, another camera spot, one up above the press box here. Um, but yeah, so this side over here is going to be the MLB field. I think it looks awesome, especially for you guys who have been wanting me to do um, another stadium. As of right now, it's probably the best you're going to get. But I think it looks so sick especially with the corn. Now we're going to pop over here to the movie side. Um, and here we've got a corn maze. And then basically what I ended up doing with this is that I went through online and I found different images. I imagine this is at least what they had last year. I don't know if this is something that they kept doing for a while. But I know I just saw a picture today of what it look, what the whole thing looks like today for the game. And it, the corn maze looks completely different. Um, but I like the version from last year better than this year, so I decided to leave it. Um, anyway, I'm going to quit rambling. If we come down here, this is going to be the actual movie site. Now, this is obviously, I guess I didn't say at the beginning of the video, this is in Iowa, probably one of the most boring states in the world, or at least in our country. I live in Iowa, only like, honestly, probably an hour away from this. I was here, I came um, to the movie site once when I was a kid, don't even remember going I just know that I've been there before. Um, but it was kind of cool to go through. I rewatched the movie, and, you know, I really wanted to make this thing look as accurate as possible. And I think it, I did. I mean, this thing is, in my opinion, stunningly beautiful. You know, we've got the, the field and everything. If we kind of come up onto the ball diamond, you can look out into the corn. I mean, other than the fact that the corn add on that I wanted to use just isn't as tall as I wanted it to be. It is, I think it's, I mean, damn near spot on. Um, let's go over here and let's look at the house. Now the house is, it's a little different. I mean, they, they use it for tours and everything. 
and they I believe they tried to keep it as accurate or as close to the movie as possible. Um, I did my best to decorate it, but pretty much it's based on what it looks like today. And then obviously over here, I'm not going to really show any of these just because these are like this, I believe, is like where they sell their souvenirs now. Um, and then there's like a big barn. It looks like they built back here. It looked like maybe they use it for like wedding receptions. And then I saw another satellite image with like a huge building that went off in this direction. And I was like, I don't think it's necessary. So I just closed it off with trees and we just, you know, we're going to keep on moving. Um, but I'm just trying to see if there's anything else outside. Not really. So let's pop in here quick. I apologize if I sound like I'm rushing too, guys. I want to get this out before the game starts. Um, but if we walk in here, here's the house. This is going to be like one dining room area. If we come in here, there's going to be the kitchen. Um, during the movie, there actually is like a tiny little TV that sits right here. Um, but obviously, it's Minecraft, and there was no way I was going to do that. Uh, if we pop over here, this door takes us back out towards the field. And then through here, this door is a bathroom, but there's nothing in there. This was my best attempt at a piano in a short period of time. Uh, we've got an old school TV there, couch, some shelves, stuff like that. Um, this window right here is actually the big one because this is the big bay window that I know that they built specifically for the movie. But they did that so that you they had a good shot of being able to see the field outside. And this right here is one of my favorite shots because we can see the movie field and then way off in the distance we can see the MLB field which is literally exactly how it would look if you were looking out of this window um, in real life so I'm I'm super super happy with it and then we've got a little rope right there because uh, the upstairs is actually closed off to the public so for the sake of this build I also closed it off to the public and it looks pretty much how you would see it if you were really there and couldn't go up there so anyway let me go back outside because that is going to be everything for the build. I hope it. I hope I was able to explain it well enough. I hope I'm not rushing it too much. Um, but like I said, I mean, I have spent. I started this build today is Thursday, August 11th. I started this on Monday, so that would be like what four days ago, three days, four days. Um, and this was nothing four days ago. I've and I think over the last two days, I know I've spent well over 24 hours building on this thing. So I'm hoping you guys enjoy it. Um, I know they say, you know, they said in the movie, if you build it, they will come. I truly hope that people come watch this because I put a lot of work in to make this thing look as good as I possibly can. And yeah, I'm super, super happy about it. So with all that being said, guys, I just want to thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you hit the like button down below. You have no idea how much it helps me out. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and that notification bell as well while you're down there. Show me that uh, the, the extra work I put in the last few days to get this thing done was worth it. Um, I would most definitely appreciate it. Aside from that, guys, I just want to thank you guys for watching. Have a good one.